Don't be scared to be seen. Took me 38 years to break out of my shell. This is something that I never, ever in my entire life <laughs> thought would happen. I didn't feel like I belonged in fitness, but I'm wrong. It's been harder for me to get the weight off because I've got polycystic ovarian syndrome. People will just look at you and think the absolute worst. When you walk down the street and somebody yells out the window, you are too fat to be seen in public, you should put a paper bag on your head, that's hard to deal with. I wanted to try anything I could. I would dread going into the gym. I didn't feel good enough about myself. I wanted to get a bike, but they were too expensive. And I just thought that I would never find any type of physical activity that I would enjoy. And I thought I was gonna die. I thought I was gonna die early. And then I found Supernatural. And that's all she wrote. <laughs> Okay, so imagine you're standing in your living room, you put on this small headset, and suddenly you're standing at the foot of a glacier in Iceland or on the Great Wall of China. A coach meets you there and then guides you as you smash targets to the beat of your favorite music in an amazing aerobic workout. There are no mirrors, no judgment, just you feeling powerful and losing yourself in the moment as your endorphins totally catch fire. The day I finished my first workout, I was hooked. And I've been using Supernatural for 307 days to be exact. Yes, in a row. It's raining man. I'm all about singing and performing and dancing and I feel graceful when I'm in that headset. It would take me an hour to do a 20 minute workout when I started and now I can do two hours without resting. And that is insane. I started to make friends in the community and it was amazing. Nobody judged me. Everybody was cheering me on. And that was an amazing feeling that I wasn't really used to. Because Chesney embodied everything we're about, vulnerability, inclusivity, celebrating yourself, and falling in love with movement, we knew she had to be more than just a community member. We knew we had to get her into the studio so that she could inspire others. I think it was Caitlin that reached out to me and said, hey, we want to include you in on this customer feedback call. And I'm like, oh, yeah, I'll do that. I'd, I'd love to just kick things off asking, like, how you even heard about us? And, oh, it looks like we have someone joining. Hold on one second. OK. is racing i feel like i'm meeting a celebrity right now like i'm freaking out <laughs> okay. so listen um at supernatural all of us our entire team has been so into and excited and thrilled and fallen in love with watching you share your fitness journey and we've put together a little slideshow that we want to share with you you at every step shared with total transparency and joy <laughs> so much beauty and vulnerability and we were all just so amazed at every step we got to see your day 60 we got to see you break a hundred thousand points we got to see you break your hundredth day of straight working out in supernatural at every moment we were absolutely <laughs> amazed and then we saw this post and chesney i don't know if you know but we all fell in love with you. <laughs> no, will you let us bring you to Los Angeles so that we can have you coach your own supernatural workout? Are you serious? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Everything that it is to be a coach you've shown us and we're so <laughs> proud. And we really would love to bring you out to be a guest coach so that we can help make this dream a reality. Yes. <laughs> I mean, I couldn't, I should probably ask my husband, but I, I think he's okay with it.
Every one of our coaches will tell you this, that if your heart wants you to help other people in this way, then like you got the qualifications and the rest of it is so easy. I'm going to so, be honest. I feel like I've just shattered the glass ceiling. You might as well be like Cher or Madonna at this point. Like all of us are like, it's Chesney Day, it's Chesney Day. Like, <gasps> this is insane. <laughs> It's amazing to be a coach. There's so much work that goes into it, so much heart and soul. It's exhausting, but it's rewarding. I wanted to focus on self-love and confidence. I wanted that to be the entire message of the workout because I don't think you can get enough of that. Love and care goes into every single one of these workouts. It, there's a huge spectrum. I used to tell people I listened to anything from Manson to Hanson. I was a dancer. Anything to do with like complex movement, I absolutely love it. We'll, we'll make it work. <laughs> yes. I had braced myself for like a very grueling experience to bring someone who didn't have any kind of professional training up to speed. And in reality, like, it was amazing. Her performance was so authentic. Don't be scared to be seen. It took me 38 years to break out of my shell. <laughs> I can't wait to do her workout. I don't know if my Oculus is ready for all of the tears that I'll probably cry into it. <laughs> I wanna speak to those who are struggling with their weight, who feel that they cannot do the workouts. I want them to know that they can, and they can do it at their own pace. That's what I did. Just open up, just let it take hold. Do a workout, listen to emotional music and just open yourself up, let it, let it flow. We're gonna start with some walking knees, getting the hips warmed up. Now I remember my first Supernatural coaching experience and I was very nervous. How are you feeling? If I had my heart rate tracker on, it'd probably be over a hundred. Now let's stretch out the upper body, straighten both arms, start to row one arm.